Hey beauties, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica, the Dancing Ava Lady. Today we are doing a review on this macadamia oil revitalizing body mousse. Let's do this. <laughs> This was requested by the wonderful Pam. I asked a question about what should I do next? And this was the first thing that she said. So we are trying this out today. Now, if the camera looks a little bit weird, it's because I'm using Zoom. I'm having issues, I got a new phone, having issues with setting up my gimbal because it's not recognizing my phone. And I need to get this done. So as we are doing it, we're just getting things done. Um, now, before we get started, if you're new to this channel, there, there goes my squeaky chair. If you're new to this channel, make sure you do click the subscribe button as well as the little bell icon beside it because every single week I either have a live stream or a beauty product review that I will be sharing with you, possibly both. Aim is both, but time will tell. We'll just have to wait and see what 2022 will bring, yeah? And so, um, and of course, guys, if you enjoy this video, make sure you do social love Give me a big fat thumbs up because it helps out this channel a lot. All right, let's get right into it. This is a aerosol can and it is the Velmont, 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 I don't know, macadamia oil revitalizing body mousse. It's supposed to be super nourishing. And um, according to Avon, you experience the revitalizing benefits of macadamia oil enriched with vitamin E and antioxidants. The creamy whipped formula melts into your skin, leaving a feeling incredibly soft and supple. It is dermatologist tested and so I am hoping that this will give me relief for my severely dry skin especially on my legs it is right now the middle and dead of winter I just got out of the shower hence the beautiful crazy hair that you're seeing right now and yes I did get a haircut I will be chronicling that probably in my vlog channel because my husband cut my hair <laughs> So yeah, I just got out of the shower. I did my face already, but I haven't done my legs yet and they are itchy. My skin gets really dry, especially in the winter because we have the heat on and I hate being cold. So therefore we heat and therefore I dry and I itch. So over the last while, I have been testing out this hemp seed ultra nourishing dry body oil. It's a nice product and overall I do enjoy it now the body wash I really really did enjoy I didn't think I enjoyed it at first when I first tried it but I did really end up enjoying it my only qualm I guess if you will with this is that it doesn't it feels like because it is a dry oil um and I do notice this a lot whenever I use like a more oil product is that it feels like it sits on my skin a little bit and I don't like that as much. I can work it in, but it takes time. And sometimes I, if I can just get like 15 minutes to myself to shower, that's already a blessing of a day. <laughs> now, the other thing that I'm not extremely loving about this is the application. I wish it came in a, some sort of a pump because it gets really oily on the outside of the container. So that, that I have it sitting on the top of my beauty station with some tissue under it so it doesn't get my, my, my beauty station all oily, oily here. So anyway, so this should solve at least the dispensing issues that I have and I'm very curious as to what this smells like. According to the Fast Facts on the Avon website, this is a great product for anybody who loves premium personal care products that um, is infused with like super luxe natural ingredients. It's going to feel good. It's good for you. And um, those who also like a more mousse texture for a post shower body care or post bath body care. And it's also great for people who are looking for long lasting hydrations, which also include antioxidants and soothing effects for your skin. So that sounds like me a lot because I don't like it when my skin gets very dry. It also gets itchy, which is no buenos for me. Now, this is supposed to just kind of like melt into my skin. So I'm going to assume that it's supposed to really, really just absorb into my skin super quick, which will be fantastic. And it's supposed to help reduce the signs of aging in the skin, maintaining a youthful looking glow. Sounds wonderful. Now, I did do some research outside of this uh, from the Avon website as to why is macadamia nut oil and what's the benefits of it. And there are a few different things. So I did do a bit of digging outside of the Avon website to see what else is the macadamia nut oil is good for. And according
according to the puresense.co.in website, um, they do list a lot about the different benefits of macadamia nut oil in general, but specifically for your skin, it's supposed to help things with like rashes and reduce itchiness. Great because my legs feel like there's little ants crawling all over right now um, because it's been a, a minute or two since I've gotten out of the shower and stuff. So I need, I need to moisturize my skin. And then also it helps to repair scars and stretch marks. Great because I have a surgical scar. I should have a couple surgical scars from also having a baby, well, having two babies through via C-section stretch marks. And then also I have like some scars from like um, cysts that were removed on my body. And then also it helps to prevent premature wrinkles because it does contain a rare antioxidant called squalene, uh, squalene that helps to prevent premature formation of wrinkles in your skin by shooting up the regeneration of skin keratinocytes. And they do say that macadamia oil benefits baby skin, mature skin, dry skin, enhances useful ingredients like eye cream and lip balms because it does have great levels of hydration. Now, I am not going to use this on my eyes, nor am I going to use this on my lips because that's not what this is made for. And I'm, I'm not sure if I should have it so close to my face. So this is not going anywhere near my face. This is just going to go on my body. Um, also states that, of course, it here's chapped lips. So, I mean, I have chapped legs. Should work, right? Let's open this up. As you can see, I have not opened it up yet. I've got this a long time ago. It's been a minute or two since I've been meaning to do this video. I have, hey, this is the first video I'm actually shooting in here that I'm going to be editing. Ooh, that's exciting. But yeah, I've been meaning to do video like to record more videos. Like I say, we were having a scheduling issue when it came with just finding time because Ginevra also does online school in our room where I used to shoot. So that's that. The room isn't completely set up yet, but I did get curtains and they look very fabulous. You can see them on Instagram. So here is the product here. And all I'm supposed to do is I need to shake it before using and massage it into your body. And according to the Avon website, I massage it onto dry skin. So my skin is definitely dry by now. I'm going to give this a shaky shake. And this is actually 190 grams or 6.7 ounces. Pop off lid. Oh, 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 I like that. All right, let's give this a squeezy scoop. I wonder if it's going to foam like hair mousse. Why are you not going? I'm pressing, but nothing's happening. Did I do it wrong? Can I be pressing wrong? Okay, let's try to get a little harder. Whoa, why is it not working? Oh, 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 there we go, there we go, there we go. I was just pressing the wrong angle. Oh, hey, look at it puff up. Oh, wow, and that was like a fairly gentle squeeze that I did as well, guys. But here it is. Oh, the uh, sucks. The quality of the video does suck. By next video, guys, I record, I promise I will have my phone set back up. But here it is. Mm. Oh, it smells delicious. A little light fragrance. Mm, it smells like a cookie. <laughs> I want to eat it, but I won't. No, it had, in all seriousness, it has like that cookie esque essence. Um, yeah, it's because it has like this sweet scent to it. Maybe a little vanilla or a vanilla scent. Oh, it smells so nice, guys. I'm hungry now. So it's very, very light. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, I'm going to try. Ooh, ooh, rubbing it into my hands, a smidgy smooth. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna rub into my arms first. La, la, la. Oh, okay, okay. Is it melting? Is it melting? Okay, later on, I'm gonna do one leg first and then the other leg afterwards. Okay, so I just did this one arm. I did a little bit on this side, but not nearly as much. It is fairly absorbed into my skin already. Nice, hey, and I can use it to like... <laughs> Shape the angle of my arm hair. It's a really nice light set, like super nice. And on my hands, like I can feel that I have the moisture on, but it doesn't feel like it's, you know, like oily. It does feel hydrated, but it doesn't feel like it has this like weird oily, oily texture. Like a little bit, if anything. 
but it just feels like I have like what I have like when I have hand cream on, right? Oh, it's very, very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, I want to try it on my legs now here. I can probably move you. I should see my legs a little bit more. This is my legs. That is my best. But yeah, my legs are here. They are dry. It's, there is a, like a white cast to my legs because my skin is so dry and it does get really itchy. You'll see like scars from where I'm like scratching and things. So you'll see scars from like where I'm scratching and things. So it does get really, 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 really itchy. So what I am going to do, I'm going to do one side and not do the other side just for a few minutes because I'm going to be super itchy. Otherwise, if I don't, I'm going to put... I really like how it comes out. It's really fun. All right, so I'm going to do one side here. It almost feels like shaving cream, right? And that scent is lovely. So it's not scent free. So there is definitely a fragrance. And yeah, just like that guys, it already feels like my, my legs have like drank up the moisture. It's like, feed me more, Jess, feed me more. All right, let's do some more. I have to say though, it is a little hard to press. I'm, I'm yeah, it is a little bit harder to press than I thought it would be. That's okay. It's going to be a workout for my fingers and my thumbs. And then I'm going to do my belly. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to beep this part out so you guys don't have to see my belly. I don't think there's anything wrong with my belly. But it absorbed really, really quick. Like, really quick. Like, I really like how quickly it has absorbed, to be honest with you. All right, and now let's check out my legs because my legs now have had an extra minute to absorb it. Hello, feet. <laughs> okay, so from what I see is that the one side, it does look, if it, it looks definitely more hydrated. Like it, it's not as, um, yeah, it definitely feels a lot more hydrated and it feels less rough. Like this side, feels a lot more rough and it does have that like slight ashy texture. This is the leg that I didn't do anything with right now. And this is the leg that I have applied on. All right, so this side, nothing. This side I've applied. Wow, it's a lot softer actually. See like how dry that is? It's already better. Yeah, okay. No, I'm just going to do a little bit on my knees so you can see how quickly it absorbs in. Check that out. A bit. So much better already. All right, so hopefully it'll help with like these little irritating spots that um, has been bothering me for a while. Discovered that if I put it on the table and I squeeze that way, it's actually a lot easier. Like this and press this way, it's easy. It's when I was trying to do it like this, being all difficult. Don't know why I decided to make it so difficult. That's when it was a little bit more difficult. Definitely easier, put it on a flat surface, stable surface. It was easy peasy getting it up and on. It's like super fast absorbing, like super fast absorbing. I, I can't get over how quickly this is absorbing and especially after I've been using the uh, the dry oil for so long. We're gonna take a pause. This video is not done yet. I'm going to see how my legs are tomorrow morning after I wake up because that's usually a pretty good telltale sign of how well it did moisturize if it lasts the overnight. So we'll see you in the morning. Good morning. It is now the next morning. I am back in my downstairs office area because this little dude. Nope. You know, little dude is just playing away and Ginevra's already set up for school. Just a quick review on my leg. Last night went to bed. No itching at all. It was amazing. It was so good. And then today. Yeah, boo boo. It's pretty good. There we go. It's pretty good. You can see some of the dryness is coming back. So. I mean, the thing is, I have like insanely dry skin on my legs. My arms feel super soft, like super duper soft. So definitely 
it's really great for softening and keeping your skin really really moisturized my legs they are I'm a little disappointed that they are like the dryness is back a bit so it's um I think it's one of those products that feel good and it smells amazing but it's not as long lasting as I need in parts of my body for me. Now, some of you guys, if you don't have a severely dry skin on your legs as I do, by all means, you're not gonna have that problem. Um, and it could also be something that you need to use over time to just kind of like, you know, was it that like, kind of like rebalance your skin's microbiomes, I guess. It might be, I don't know, don't quote me on that. But it's just like the healthy state of your skin and just kind of regulate the oral production of your skin. But like I say, my legs have always been insanely, insanely dry. Um, and it's, it's not bad, like at least it's not itching, which is good. If you have any questions, please leave a comment in the box below and let me know in uh, what type of moisturizer are you using right now? I've never used a mousse moisturizer before, so that was definitely a really cool and fun experience. It, I do really enjoy how well it absorbed into my skin, how quickly it absorbed into my skin. So I do really, really enjoy that. All right, guys, if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed today's content, make sure you do show some love. Give this video a big fat thumbs out. Also, I just launched a brand new channel, guys. So make sure you do check that out. This is mom life, as many of you guys know. Anyways, uh, I just launched a brand new channel called Passions to Paycheck with Jessica Yick, where I will be migrating the majority of my uh, campaign planners, as well as there's going to be um, tips in there and ideas in there about, thank you, JJ, about mom life, and, not mom life, about um, work from home life, as well as things that you could do to help your business, even if it's not specifically with Avon. All right, I love you guys. I'll see you guys next one. Bye. Bye. Say bye. Say bye. Bye. Say bye. Big bye. Big bye. Big bye.